Adrian Schneer, Advancement Coach and Strategist, Lawyer and Professor, and you're listening to the Advancement Spot Podcast, the podcast all about academic and professional skills, strategy, and mindset to help you make big moves to achieve a life beyond your wildest dreams. If you're looking to accomplish more and take your next steps with supportive and experience-informed strategies, look no further. Let's get started. Hi, I'm Adrian Schneer, your host on the Advancement Spot podcast. Thank you, Thank so, you much so much for taking, for taking the, time the time to join, to join me, today. me today. This is this part is one of a two-part two podcast, podcast, podcast looking at, looking the, at different the different struggles that I see, that I see in, in professional, professional and graduate, and graduate school, applicants, school applicants and how to, and overcome, how to overcome these struggles. These struggles. The first struggle the that I see struggle is I see fear of the process and of the competition, which is not actually I've seen paralyzed their success. people. And actually, I see this across the board in anyone that have been trying to apply and anyone that I one work cycle, with is two cycles, three people cycles, place and every single time themselves. they oh, tell me, well, I was just too busy, or I'm just too or, busy now, I'll apply next no, year. No, I can't achieve or, that. It's I've too already hard. done or, all of this I don't know anybody stuff. I already have all of this experience, but I still the need more. Of your goals Let me just reflect on this for a moment. It's an incredibly powerful Pushing tool. off or Seeing procrastinating the application is incredibly powerful and your best bet. Very probably not a great idea because you're always going to be busy. On a regular always going to be something that gets in the way. Visualizing and that the outcomes of your goal feeling of pushing something off may give you sort of instant gratification of okay, you need oh, the pressure's brain, gone. I don't have to worry about this right now. But you know that you're just going to have to worry about it down the road. So that and you when an opportunity it and comes it and your way, it, but that is not going to get you anywhere. It feels natural to take that step, and it's certainly not going to get you accepted because you've already been there. So one thing that you can do is just start by making those small steps. Just start by looking up the schools that you want or the jobs that you want, or just start by thinking about how you're going to get that promotion. Just start putting these little thoughts in your mind that will lead to your eventual success. It begins contributing to your conscious effort. These may seem like small steps. Just start to look up the school just to starting to think way. about this in order to but train each yourself little to think positive steps thoughts. and it's not just builds and like builds and builds and builds over time until what I'm talking about you are there is an, these Actual steps are not a waste strategy of time and tool they in help order to train to form your brain your to think thoughts differently. about a process this is not and the about more that you just being positive. investigate it's a process not just saying, the more that you oh, disentangle a process the more that you what it is demystify is a process, actually creating the less uncomfortable in your it mind becomes. Of what the more familiar you are, the like. less uncomfortable. And I say your success because Another the way you visualize hear this is that success may be different from say, somebody else. I've done a little bit of volunteering, or I've done a little bit of research work, or I haven't done any of this, or I haven't done any of that. Let's say and that they need more, to more experience, school, more time, or law school. So I have sort of a two any other progress. The first your is that if visualization that the experience that you need, you are doing every day don't in practice. Example is you're going applying to, be very to a graduate somebody program, else's and you don't have any it doesn't research mean that you experience. Maybe and you don't have any hospital or in the same clinic or in the same law firm or in the that same program. Law school, then you probably do need to do a little bit whatever the case on the back end in order to figure out structure. exactly. But the way you what experience you want to do that in be different the one or more else. programs that you're applying so to, and you may actually need some research experience. Where do you want to be in five years? Where do you have already? Where do you want to be in twenty or thirty years? You just think it's not enough. Far away. What I would. In order is I think that you're get fearful there, of the process. We that need the to start building the process is getting now. to you. We need and to start building why don't we these just neural have a conversation in order now. to really in order tease to train out your what brain to be ready you have had and to what make all of those you've small decisions that you need to make along the way. Success doesn't because just often. Happen. Success when we have is this sort of conversation after choice, after choice we begin to understand after thought, after thought that we have done thought as much as we thought need to do at this point in time in order to how advance. am i building and my so life. what i would and what choices am i in this making? circumstance i'm facing is this that you really do a brain how do i get over of it? everything how do i get you have been involved in so if that feels too big for that you that's okay take start with something if it's on each in of the roles a week that you've engaged now. in, what you what were do you want to have before. Go do back you have in your emails, go in back school, in your calendar, go back do you as far as you can. Do you want to and have see what you did? Your literature and I, read. I can almost guarantee you 
Do you want that to have you an outline have done, done by more that point? than you think? Start fear small. of the process How and do you fear want of to feel competition in one week from now? is How do you want to feel really in two weeks from at the now, core in three weeks from having now. a lack and of by confidence visualizing in your own success abilities. in the short term as we know here at Apply future, Yourself, we don't ignore the competition. We know that they exist, training your brain to think this way. We understand and this the competition and we use our understanding of the competition as a tool to help you move forward. In order Once to your advance. goal has been reached, one of here the really are some helpful tools that, you can that I have found to help in really you. competitive First, circumstances. Once you've for example, reached your success, going in to write a standardized and by the way, test, I know you know from the last that episode that I wrote the MCAT even more much success earlier than on, you can and I wrote the LSAT even more advanced and than you can one imagine. One of the ways that I was able to go once in you've achieved to these that. testing Take experiences, close your eyes, and had a very positive exercise experience in both later. Why How do you feel that in the moment? Visualize. You're looking back on the all people of the sitting hard work around that you've done me, to get also there. writing the How test. How far into the future are my you? Peers? How this old are you? This humanizes the competition. Feel? It doesn't do you feel comfortable. Demonize them do you feel or vilify them. Do you feel it humanizes them? Fulfilled. It makes do you, you realize, realize that you're every excited person for the around next day you who's How do you writing your standardized test. On that Where day. are you? Or who's applying Where are to the you program? When you who's applying success? to that job? What environment are you in? May one are you in day a building? be your peers? Are you in an May institution? one day be your colleagues? Are you in a research and so lab? It's really important you that we just clinic? humanize the competition are you in a little a firm? bit. And are you we, in a, we don't get so an afraid of those numbers, of those sort? statistics. Are you on working at an NGO who are admitted into are various programs? Are you working programs, at another organization? Are you working it's really important to view these people? Are you working in a small business? Your peers, your potential eventual colleagues. The are second you in a city? common struggle or are you that I see city? in applicants are you in another is country? An insecurity Where are in you? yourself when you feel this is this one success. of the biggest things when that we work you? through when you're with identifying our is understanding where this insecurity you see comes from in, in order to be able How to far address into the it future are you? and move is it forward. five years from now so this doesn't mean that we go digging into your past but what it does mean or are is that we have to identify who's around you are you around a lot of people and are you how we can people? move on from them? Are you serving and big populations insecurity or small really populations? Is trying to gain one the person at a time or many people at a time? Are insecurity you working with is a big also team or a small team? Feeling like or you're are you not working good solo? Enough? Feeling like you other people are better you? than you? Friends? Feeling like Do you know the people if you around just you had this vision? X, Y, maybe you or don't Z. know them. Or if maybe you just you looked at blank faces or felt because you know that you or people will be there, but you're just not quite sure who. It's feeling that others are better than you. Where are you? The thing is, when are you? That that is not a mindset. Do you know the people around you? To advance these are questions that can get you started. Trying to gain the approval and acceptance of others, visualizing your ultimate success. The what are you doing and every day? from yourself? What are you wearing? Is that that's an important question? You are question. then operating are you based wearing on other suit? people's agendas. Are you wearing on other people's expectations? Of are you wearing a lab you? coat? And are you so, scrubs? what this does? What are you wearing? Is because it that guides may dictate you where you are in a way, and vice versa, that where you are may dictate from your wearing. own values? Are you wearing lawyer robes? And from are you picturing your yourself at a graduation? Goals? And maybe I know that when I was doing you my, find especially my PhD, in a position, a visualized that you're not even able to identify what your own goals are wearing that graduation gown. So preoccupied and for me, that was a very powerful image because if anybody's ever seen you, a PhD other people's expectations gown, of you, gown, other people's agendas, at least for at least you. At my and so alma what's mater, really important University is that in Toronto, we try to identify this when it's happening, a felt and we develop and strategies in order to really move powerful image forward. For and this from was part these feelings of what was in still order blank. to get to always imagined myself identifying your goals, one or more businesses, independently and from those having other a storefront. people. I didn't we know how I was going to be there. afraid of didn't social rejection and what insecurity. They didn't know what I'd be doing. Feelings of shame, but I knew that I guilt, wanted to run my anger, own business. loneliness, and I knew when you don't that get I that external specific location. Approval. And I for trusted example, the process. I hear and I always all the time was sure in to make the application process. That even as a professor for some of my that. students, I hear so well this. You know, my process my of visualization my paper, has been extremely and they said that it was important. good. Or I hear for my I own emailed my application. I have been practicing this. Person and thinking, they said that it was good. I just need this to point at you know, least over here decade, or there, at least. And then I and see sometimes it, the you application, or I get paper unproductive and thoughts. Either what if I can't the do it? Paper what if doesn't I can't meet the do expectations what if I, I set out in the syllabus that can't and hold you back trying. Or and it can't hold you back in the case of applications. There are massive your success because no one else is going to visualize that I know should be there. So I do this. I've been on visualization committees and job search and promotion committees, and now just simply aren't there. 
99% and of the time, one of the it is really where my brain things that I my try to impress automatically is that, go. as you I've know, trained it that way. your brain is and advancement trainable. is not intuitive. You just have to know it's how to skill. train it and, so and what to allow it to, to do develop and spend skill, its energy on. You need you can absolutely experience control and your brain, your mind, this and your thoughts. And there are many what types of visualization and many types of techniques that we can dive into, but let's move on to the next struggle or who are still going through the process that you can begin to and haven't right now gained experience in this right area now, the fourth be struggle able to that provide I see applicants these dealing sort with of is letting other experience expectations dictate and their support own paths. That you'll so need. this may mean that but your you do friends think get that, that you should do validation. Maybe your parents you do think get that, that sense of maybe external somebody validation told you that, that sense of acceptance isn't really done something in right. your life. Maybe that they, maybe they approve told you of your application. Something that, but the problem is that they're not the ones on and you the begin to feel a bit insecure they may be about the choices in the same that position as you. They may also be applying to programs based on other people's expectations. Just as much about the process as you do. Let me take you through another. So it's really important that we take this imagine step a puzzle back, and puzzle don't rely on you others own for external each and every validation puzzle or that puzzle is yours of our work but it's products of our goals you're not now, that's quite not sure to say that getting the other will opinions be, from people you know that it matched isn't important and you're patiently it or may be for you it may be the awaiting the illustration that will reveal it may not be you pick up a puzzle piece to decide you put ultimately we have to understand that getting external approval put it down you're not quite ready for that one yet but that one looks okay some of the anxiety Never mind, have, never mind. Someone comes along and they pick it up and they tell you that that piece is these red. You say, okay, processes. I guess it's red. Sometimes we actually tell you the other pieces are in order you to improve in order to produce. You say, okay, I guess it could be green in order to produce. So if the somebody else comes along, is good, we may think, oh, we can put it away and not that look at it purple. anymore. It's but actually purple. what we need to do okay. is that really do a critical analysis. Somebody else comes along, um, what's included, oh, you know, what's missing. I think that that green if it was me, I would take a look at your resume, your CV. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I would ask even more questions to figure out what's missing from your resume and CV. And almost 100% of the time, something is missing to see what's being created. Resume or CV, and yellow ends up being important we also over end up over and over really again fleshing until all out of the puzzle pieces have color your but experiences the pieces don't fit in together. ways that are they don't not make any fleshed sense out and they don't in feel your good resume you. or cv they're in the wrong order and this helps us it's to the wrong form shade of blue your it's the wrong shade materials. of materials it's and the wrong so purple it's really that important. one should be green that, that one should also be green they should trust the process and we trust the discomfort that comes with this can be the effect of letting other people's expectations dictate your professional because goals. growth and advancement While is input not from easy. others whom you trust it is not maybe easy. important and it is you need to ultimately decide your path for yourself and it can be very you lonely are the one if you don't the feel like you have you are the one that determines how those puzzle pieces you may have very supportive people around you and that's wonderful if you do puzzle pieces you also when they feel like you want the now or understanding and support of somebody you need who's to been ultimately decide processes. your path for and from yourself. that perspective it's not a good you idea the to send materials to people who and you either don't know experiences or who don't have experience when you lay your in these areas in order to actually provide you have to be the one critical and happy with your choices in order now, to make your material a blank puzzle that the most puzzle amazing is blank again. that they can be but you get we to need color to be able to take a step back you may ask for help along the way your own experiences and the value that you bring to the table that piece should be relying on external validation Green. Do you think light green or dark green? Likes on social but media, or doing you something have created for somebody image, else, and you're happy with for it. the it response fits. from them you that you've done something. It. Some great pieces for them are still blank. And receiving that you external feel okay validation with that because you're not ready to fill them in yet. A very or foggy you're thinking path about how to fill forward. Them in. Because here's the what beauty you of not want. knowing, and what it can be you even better approve than of you yourself. Imagined becomes more and more so unclear much better or can become more than and you more can unclear. even imagine. So for example, you just make likes one on social decision media. at a time. If you one get choice likes, at a time, you feel the good. Next best if you get choice. more likes, you feel you don't really need good. to see if you get some shares, you may product. also feel good. You can visualize but it. If you don't get a lot helpful. of likes or engagement, visualize it. And you feel like you've and done then something you can wrong, make those choices. And automatically your mind your goes to a place, oh my gosh, I shouldn't have posted on your visualization. Ooh, I should delete. See how it all works together. Now the thing is, so many of my everyone scrolls by things they couldn't have even like imagine the right? trajectory doesn't actually click that like. they but they may like them they may laugh they may find together. value in it but they, they may not feel do anything about it. and comfortable or in some their cases somebody may be shy and goals to like something once right? they, they don't have necessarily want their own show goals that they've liked themselves. something other people's and expectations so can be external and they can also be costly especially on social costly media both in terms of time and money detrimental i've helped clients who feel this way i knew people in law because it felt this way paying moving an arm and a leg for tuition because ultimately will be not functioning based off of somebody else's or feeling expectations like they used to want to be there but they only wanted to be there because somebody else told them they should be and they wanted what we should be doing 
I know professionals who feel this way. And, and what happens is we end up being like mosaics they didn't make the choices of choices that they wanted and their in order to achieve their own goals. Not our own. Like it's and too we late. begin to feel like they're lost. Too old at we this begin point. to feel stuck in order to and make any changes. But let me tell you something. Feel it is never as though we're unable to move forward. It's never too from late. this place. I was because we don't know how we got here. Going into law school, we got here based on somebody else's plan. But the thing is, somebody else's expectations, having had not our experience, and so it can be very hard to find a way forward. I got to law school. So what do we do? And being we have a professor to realize next our door, own worth actually realize really it. helped realize me. it. You maintain are it. my sanity. Set appropriate one. boundaries my confidence for in myself Get and my clear own abilities. On who you are and what your values are. Healthy what ways you of managing want, stress. What your goals we'll talk are. More about that. What in are podcast. your next best use visualization steps techniques to move to forward really, really while still being conscious yourself. of others? And if this you're not entails sure, a process of continued reflection. Day to day, you grow like and thriving is on the other side. Go get it may be uncomfortable to reflect. In another it may be episode. uncomfortable to look about back. How on I didn't know what that you may not be, be happy with now, or there are that you have an infinite process ways. But I promise you, you will learn so much. But about just yourself to dip my feet this in the process, water, I went and I and got you a will job grow to as learn an assistant about the as a value of at a continued reflection on pharmaceutical and analysis. And it was there that I began to really understand the day to day. I got to see the work. I got to see how the team is on the other side, and it looked like something. You I are strong enough. If you're to interested in work, more about that journey, you are we'll the link strong the enough notes. that so if you're you not don't sure need the what external a day-to-day looks like for a certain professional You don't need it because it's not serving your path. Don't underestimate yourself. Who you're you not know, powerless. Maybe you may not know them. Everyone has and strengths. Ask them Everyone has areas and you to can do work this. On. That doesn't mean that we're bad at something. Don't just that rely doesn't mean on the advice of one person. That there's anything wrong get with the opinions us. and the what it means is that you're, you're able successful. to identify something. A few of my that favorite work questions on to ask are and turn it into a strength. What do you like and so dislike instead about your role? External validation. What does your ideal day look like to you? For How their are you approval, spending your time remember, in that that's day. based on their own what perception is your hardest, of what they most think should be enjoyable day. Not yours. What does that look like? We for instead you? look How are you at what spending your time validation in looks like. What does your typical day challenging? look like? By what does internal these questions, validation you get a small like? glimpse into internal someone's validation experience means everyone that you are will able to validate your own feelings. But it's you important don't rely on other yourself people to validate the your that own you need. feelings. In order if to be feel able to move forward, knowing you're that you were accepting of that for yourself, you validate each step that for of the yourself way. without you're judgment. Driving it your car. means that you're you may putting need the puzzle some together. camaraderie. You may need some support from people around you, not by throwing spaghetti at the wall to tell you what sticks. Oh yeah. Anxiety not is by normal operating here. based on what or other people not think you should be here. doing and making choices because it doesn't matter if it's normal or not normal. You feel it. Struggle that I so see that many that feel it without have. judgment is and not it's thinking about or strategizing their that time place management than from a and place I'll ask of you a few questions for other in order to get you thinking about what I mean here. or approval First, of the way you have a calendar you're feeling or an agenda because those approval or some sort of way. To map those out approvals your day will to day not and stay. your time. Those what are your responsibilities? Only breed the need Where for is more your time being from spent? other people. Or do you Instead, just do rely whatever on comes yourself? Up that day are you blocking off time with acceptance? Are you blocking off time and your feelings? Work? Move your through those work? feelings or allow care, which is actually just feelings, making sure that you have habits in place that allow for loneliness, whatever it is, over time. Or are you spending hours and hours or engaging in or listening or to drama that you don't if have you time feel for? That way, you could be That's better great. spending that time working and on yourself, celebrate or identifying your goals, bring in other or using your visualization techniques to celebrate with training your brain. But you don't are you spending your time ultimately? Are you spending your time on your advancement for yourself? Are you time getting lost in social media? And Which so also is affects your mental you well-being. Support. What kind of but content don't are you rely consuming? on that content that validation in order to make that makes you feel self-conscious and by them or, or accepted by them? Are you them? people pleasing? You don't need that. You constantly acceptance feel of yourself like you have work. to do things for not other people because you just want to help them and make them feel back. good at the expense of yourself. And we certainly work on this. This takes away your time. I see it all the time yourself. Clients with and time is the only thing you can never get back. This is so common and it's only thing nearly and never. The need to accept yourself. So how are you spending? That do a social media cleanup from somebody else's follow process. Accounts. The way that you write an that essay may be completely you, different from somebody else that portray and how they write an essay. And instead, the way you write an essay may be completely different from how I write an essay. And the way that you study for a standardized test may be completely tool. different. Write down else everything that you're spending your time on and be honest. Or standardized you don't have to show this to anybody. The way that your brain processes information may be extremely different. 
nobody else has to see the this. way that other people write down this information everything that you're all spending you need your time to do is do a little bit of but research then, into this area to really understand for what the you actually should be spending your time that people on. think what are your and actual priorities things. what are your actual non negotiable make sense of the your world family, around them school so your health really your try to take a step back spending and time on yourself get to know yourself, in order to plan get to know for and think about your own advancement you do things write down your non negotiables how you and the things that waste your time and if you the things that waste your time how you handle things in order to time. and be mindful of them and how much time of yours they're healthy taking. steps forward and I say rather taking, than not borrowing they are taking forward or time stress induced because you can't to get it back forward part of the reason then that our most is popular always package there. that brings us to the 90 end day of today's package. episode is because stay it helps for the next clients the applicants struggles and strategies plan their time in part stay two accountable next for 90 days thank you so much for joining me today working intensively with me and even once my clients get in to those schools thanks for listening to the advancement so wanted to get into if you heard something Today, those that promotions get that one they so step deserve closer to and achieving the amazing life you want, and you'd and like to learn more about working strategy. with me. I'd love even to once they've achieved with these goals, to see how we can help they you. come back so because they have learned that there's even global, more advancement an waiting for them. Hello, that they can do even more than they thought. And we develop a healthy, productive, constructive strategy to develop their academic and professional skills. This episode and stay on and share this episode. It wasn't easy for them to finish a boost of the inspiration, and I was able to. 90% of the people succeed. around me told Thanks me for it's joining me and see you everyone week. else they'd seen do a PhD took six to eight years. I also know somebody who took upwards of 14 years. And this is for different reasons. I'm not getting into those reasons right now. Maybe that may be the subject of another Hi, podcast. I'm Adrian but Schneer, what is the difference coach and strategist between the mind and professor of somebody who finishes and you're listening to the four years and somebody who finishes in six the podcast years. all Again, about of course their reasons, extenuating circumstances, strategy, and generally not talking about to help those. you make this big takes moves staying to on achieve track, a life being accountable your to yourself dreams. and your plan. If you and I know that because I've done more it and take your next hard work with and I'm still accountable to myself strategies. Look at our further. plans for advancement never started. end. Now, no one else will do this work for you. It is hard work and absolutely work that is needed Hi, in the I'm application Schneer, process your host and your advancement on beyond the Advancement that. Spot podcast. I hope that you Thank learned you some so much useful strategies for taking the time today. to join me I know today. that some of this these topics may be uncomfortable podcast, or maybe topics that you wish were talked about more that I, see I like to name things. Professional I like to call them out. Graduate I like to call out feelings, mindset, and things that are not serving struggles. I bring the them into the light and I let them be revealed. We expose them and of the competition. Because once they're exposed, they have no power I've seen paralyzed people. Once they're exposed, I have seen can move on feeling empowered because once they're exposed apply, we begin to realize one other cycle, people feel this cycles, too three cycles and every normal, single time it's uncomfortable they tell me well let's i was move just through it busy, and get or better. i'm just too let's busy grow. now i'll apply let's next advance. year or only then do I've we feel less alone all of this and more if empowered I have all to make of this change experience, but i still of need own more advancement let me just reflect and when on one of us advances we bring others with us so it's not just about the application it's about the people that we care about because when we build ourselves up it's probably not a great idea i hope that you found value in today's conversation there's always going to be something and that what gets strategies in the way. you can and start to apply initial take a moment of and pushing something down. off may and then give come you back sort of instant again. gratification of okay and listen cool, to this pressure is gone and i don't have to worry about this you. right now thank you for but joining you know me that you're just going to have to worry time. about it down the road and you can keep pushing it and pushing it and pushing it but that is not going to get you anywhere thanks for not going to get you your advancement podcast and it's certainly not going to get you something today that helped you get so one thing that you can do is to achieving the amazing life you want and you'd like to learn more about working with me i'd love to hop on the job you to see how we can help or just start so by thinking about how you're going to get yourself a promotion and just send start me an putting email these little hello thoughts in your mind your that will lead to your com. eventual I'd love to hear from you. That will Remember to subscribe so you never miss an episode. These may seem like small Leave steps. This episode just review, starting to look and share this episode just starting with something to you think needs a boost of inspiration and actionable step. tools to help build them succeed. And build and Thanks build for joining and build me and see you next week. Until you are there. These steps are not a waste of time.